they came fleeing their homes in Bangladesh. Never before in world history have 10 million people left their homes to seek refuge in a neighboring land from the atrocities of an army in their own country. Never before in world history have three million people been killed in a period of nine months in an attempt to wipe out an entire nation. On behalf of the people of India, I have come to express our sorrow and sympathy for you. To escape injustice and brutality, you have left your country and come to ours. But only by remaining there to fight can injustice and brutality be routed out. We are a poor country, but it is our tradition to help the distressed and needy at all times. I wish you well and I hope that very soon you will be able to return to your homes and that your life and property will be safe there. West Pakistan's brutal genocide fanned the flame of resistance. The Mukti Bahini fought valiantly for independence. forces entered Bangladesh after Pakistan declared in India. The 
liberation was a joint venture between the Indian Army and the Mukti Bahini. After 14 days of war, Yahya's army surrendered unconditionally in Bangladesh. Help in the reconstruction of a mutilated country. The spark of hope flares into confidence in the hearts of millions and millions of refugees. A journey homeward to begin a new life. Every day in thousands they return to their homeland. No more terror, only freedom. It is the homecoming of a free people to a free land. Shonar Bangla. We in India had made three promises to the people. The first, that all the refugees who have come here will go back. The second, that we will help the Mukti Bahini and the people of Bangladesh in every way. And the third, that we will certainly get the Sheikh Sahib released from jail. We have fulfilled all the three promises. Bangla! Bangla! 